Hey there everyone, this is Danielle playing some more Pokemon Swoosh. Last time we got through Route 9 to Spikemouth, so we are now in Spikemouth, and we're going to have a bit of a look around. Uh, let's chat to these people, I suppose? You. Don't you dare make Marnie's more Pico cry, okay? Yeah, I'm not going to do that. M Marnie's very sweet, I'm not going to make her cry, I'm not going to make her pets cry. Any trainer who's made all the way to Spikemouth's got a right wicked look to them. Well, you made it here, so I guess there's nothing to be done. You would already be faced Piers. Piers? Like Pierre, or...? It's... I don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> so yeah, this is Spikemouth. It's, um... Basically like an alleyway. <laughs> this rocking town has a punk vibe and streets crammed with shops lined up cheek by jowl. Can I go in here? Nope. Can I open this? Nope. Can I go in here? Nope. Hey, Marnie. With the shutter closed, nobody's gonna be able to challenge the gym. I gotta look into this. I just happen to have too many of these, so I'll give you one. Got it? You can handle yourself, right? You got Piers League card. P Piers Ez? League card in your album. Okay. Oi, welcome to Spike Myth, kid. Hope you're ready for the gym mission. Hold on, mate. If you're gonna take on the gym mission, you better change into your uniform. Uh, wait, what? He's looking for the gym leader. He's straight ahead from here. Is the whole town the gym? Like, I haven't gone into a gym building. If you head back, you'll be retiring. Do you want to retire? Nah. Okay, I, I guess I'm doing the gym mission now. Is the mission to find the gym? Oh. Gym challenger. You want to get past me, but I don't want that. Basically, it's a battle between our desires. You're challenged by the Team Yell Grunt. Uh, okay, I mean... I just wanted to do some shopping and stuff. Uh, I wasn't really expecting to, to go into a gym challenge yet. That's all you had? You and your Pokemon broke through. I mean, yeah, it was really easy. You only had one Pokemon. You're supposed to have several. You have a team of up to six. I don't want to let you through. That's why I was waiting all squeezed in this crack. Since I lost, it was really all for nothing. Whatever, you won, so I guess I'll step aside. Oh, I don't have to fight you either? Okay. Can I interact with any of this? Did they forget to build an actual town here and just did a gym challenge? What, what's happening? Did you know the Pokemon move light screen? No. Mr. Mime is a dancing Pokemon. It makes for a cheery member of our team. Okay, so there's a Mr. Mime just there. Oh, I run into... It's some kind of invisible wall. You can't get through no matter how you try. Um... Can't ride my bicycle right now. What am I supposed to do? Oh, I'm meant to walk backwards. What's this? A gym challenger made it through? All of all us Team Yell members have blocked the way. Don't think we'll just let you waltz through. Uh, wh why are you doing this? Like, Marnie doesn't want you to do this. She's explicitly, like, trying to stop you from doing this very thing. Uh, Thievel? Um, alright. Hello, Thievel. Suck a bunch, huh? Yeah, that hurt. As I was saying... <laughs> Sure did. I wasn't able to properly greet you. I mean, you can greet me now if you want. I don't mind. That was totally unbelievable. Even my Pokemon are in awe of you and your team. Here, go on through. Check out our neon signs while you're at it. Um... Mr. Mime. 
Ba bari Bari. What? Okay, so the invisible wall is gone now. Oh, there's a neon sign. I am underwhelmed by this town. <laughs> okay, I can see them there. I'm yelling for no reason. Is, is the gem challenge just fight some forced battles? Did I surprise you? I'm a little surprised how much my legs hurt from that landing. If, it'll stand, if I stand still like this for too long, it'll hurt so bad I might cry. So I'll shake it off with a battle. Uh, did, did they just forget to put a city here and also a gym challenge? And instead you just fight some Team Yell Grunts in an alleyway? This feels like some very strange design went down. I guess I got a crit. Oh, charm. Yeah, I like charm. Making it less wary harshly lowers the target's attack stat. Hmm. I feel like the utility of that attack is quite low. I was thinking of Attract, which is more useful, but also very annoying in its limitation based on heteronormativity. Well, it's true that I lost, but I pushed through the pain, so you should praise me for that. Alright, now the pain's gone, I guess I better get out of here. This is really silly. Max Revive. Uh, can I go in these houses? Did they just not put a city here at all? Uh, bye, Mr. Mime. Let's go back. The HP of your Pokemon not looking so good. No, they're fine, really. I practiced that back handspring so much, even a pop star would be jealous of those moves. Were you surprised? Oh, wait, be surprised, you. While you're in utter shock, I'm gonna sneakily win this battle. I don't understand why I keep fighting one grunt when there's always two of them together. Like, all of these battles so far, there's been two grunts standing there and I only get to fight one. Pressure. I don't know what that does. Uh, uh hopefully it's not, nothing too serious. Well, battle's easy anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Right about him. Huh? Seriously? You've gotta be kidding. It's already over? What? You only have one Pokemon, that's what happens. <laughs> oh my goodness. I should have been practicing my battle skills, not my backflip skills. No, that backflip was really cool. Thanks for showing me that. Guess I'll cheer for you from now on. No, no, cheer for Marnie, she's great. Backflips, backflips, and then the Mr. Mine will get out of the way. Okay. I, I don't understand the, uh, the concept of this gym challenge at all. Like, it's just, you walk down a hallway, Team Yell takes the field. This might be the gym challenge, but won't let you ruin our cool secret hangout. Alright, time for a pincer attack. We'll do whatever it takes to win. Ah, I didn't have enough time to get my disguise ready. Oh, they haven't got the mask and stuff on. That's right, Team Yell is actually made up of Spike Myth gym trainers. I mean, I, I kind of figured. Oh, actually, I'm actually fighting two of them? Gym Trainer Joshua. Okay, um... I'm unfamiliar with Drapion, that looks a bit intimidating. Um... Let's try fire? I don't know. Probably still going to be easy because they only have one Pokemon each for some reason. Ba -ba okay, they have poison? Hmm. If they tried to poison, didn't really do anything. Alright, uh. It's 
seem to do a decent amount. So let's just do that again. Would have been better if you just lost to us. Did I lose as a member of Team Yell? Or was I beaten as a gym trainer? Um, yes. Oh, whatever. Our gym leader's up next, but he's really strong. Got that? I mean, everyone already knew the true identity of Team Yell, right? That means I won't get in trouble for not getting my disguise on, right? I <laughs> sure hope so. I mean, it's kind of obvious. But, you know. <sighs> okay. Hello, Marnie. Shut your gob. Oh, Danielle. Uh, I'm really sorry. The lot from Spikeman's telling me they locked down the city for my sake. Spikeman's just keeps getting worse and worse, and all Piers says is don't worry. So, so we decided to disguise ourselves as Team Yell and sabotage the other challenges. We thought if we could stop the other gym challenges from reaching the gym, then Miss Marnie would be the only one to win and make it to the Champion Cup. And we figured that'd increase the chances of our wonderful Miss Marnie becoming the new champion. That's no way to help someone at all. Danielle, need to bother with all the preparations or whatever. Go on in and face the gym leader. I I is that the stadium? Uh, okay. Okay, I should probably heal a little bit first. Like, my health is fine, but I could use... Uh, if I have like, an ether. I have a max elixir. I don't think I have an ether. Uh, I'll, I'll just deal. I don't know why the game's so reluctant to let me just buy ethers. Uh, oh man, Miss Marnie's scolding's going forever. Remember when she scolded her more Pico for so long it practically fell asleep. I can hear Piaz just rocking away. His Pokemon chorus sounds pretty great too. I'm gonna be giving Piaz my best yells during his battle with you. Alright. I can see he's moving his mouth, but I can't hear anything? So you're finally here, huh? See, I'm... I'm really not a great gym leader. Figured that's why nobody was coming to challenge me. I have good ears, so I overheard the whole thing about the city being shut up. When I was alone, it was like my soul was weeping. This is a simple gym stadium. We can't even Dynamax our Pokemon, but, well, I still hope to enjoy the battle. Aww. That's sweet. Now then. I'm the gym leader of Spike Mess, Piers, the dark type user. You want to challenge me, even though you know you'll lose? Then this song's for you, foolish trainer. Get ready for a mosh pit with me and my party. Spike Mess, it's time to rock. You were challenged by gym leader Piers. Piers? Sent out Scrafty. I thought Scrafty was fighting type. Maybe it's fighting dark. Everyone, cheer on my Pokemon. Let's do it, Scrafty. Intimidate the opponent. Intimidate. Yep, Scrafty has Intimidate. Alright. Um, what type is it? Dark Fighting. Okay, that makes more sense. Uh, liquidation. Used Fake Out. What's that do? Oh, it makes me flinch. Ooh. Ooh, that may be a problem. Um, let's U turn. Dark fighting. Um, I have no idea what's good against that. I'll just have a look at what moves I have and see what it says I should use. Nothing. <laughs> uh, I'll try Wild Charge. Oh, actually, Heat Crash is probably a good idea because Scrafty is not very big.
Break, break. Ooh. Super effective, yeah. Hate crash. Ooh. Come on, you can do it. Spock should be enough. One. How many Pokemon do you have? Malamar. I don't know what Malamar is. Okay. Malamar's gonna mess you all up with its contrary ability. I don't know what that does. Okay, four Pokemon. Wild Charge? I have no idea. That seems to be pretty good. Oh, okay, payback. Ooh, that's not good. Okay, now I fainted. I don't know what Contrary was supposed to do, but nothing happened. So... Obstagoon. Uh, can't back one. I think I want to use like a potion or something on this next turn. Oh yeah, Obstagoon is the... Time to be another member of my crew. Face the proud high roar of my Obstagoon. Alright. Uh, I'm just going to try a potion first. Let's see. Probably a Hyper Potion. Hang on. Uh, 60, 66. Super Potion's probably enough. Yeah, that should be fine. Use Counter, but it failed if it didn't attack. Um, I guess I'll try Liquidation? I don't really know what... I mean, they're Dark-type, I assume. But... Here's an umbra I saved just for this. You lot in the battle in the stands, but cheer me on. Throat chop. What the heck is throat chop? Yeah, bug moves are super effective, but I don't think I have anything else that has a lot of them. Um Just go a little experimental here. Go for it, Natalie. Squirrel. Perch up again. What does that move do? Uh, bullet seed. Critical hit, not very effective. Oh, bullet seed is one of these moves, right. That kind of worked, and it meant that counter didn't do very much. What if I try to counter? Oh no, we both used counter. <laughs> okay. We have the same move. <laughs> Obstruct? What does that do? Oh, it's a protect move. Okay. Oh okay, yeah, throw it, Chop. I want to counter that. There we go. Ba -da -ba -dum. Scum tank. Uh, I guess I'll keep... I don't do encores, get it? Not songs, not moves, not Pokemon. I forgot that there was a fourth one. Scum tank, uh... Yeah, it's a skunk. Everyone's gonna stink, but who cares? Go, scum tank, use your sucker punch and toxic. Use Toxic. Well, 
Well, I'm poisoned now. Badly poisoned. That's not good. Let's see, 60. Uh, I'm a person. There we go. Yeah, badly poisoned is real bad. It does more damage each time you're hurt by the poison. Fingers crossed. Sucker punch. Okay. Don't beat me, don't beat me. And that counter can do the trick. Oh, Optima? Oh. That's harsh. Oh no, Natalie. Me and my team gave it our best. Let's meet up for a battle again sometime. Got money? I'm glad we were able to battle. Seems like my Pokemon feel the same way. Here's your dark badge. Okay, is there like two more? One more? I'm not sure. You can now catch Pokemon up to level 55. Here's a uniform too. I've actually been thinking about just selling them at my concerts. Thanks. My little sis Marnie's probably going to challenge me next, I bet. That was actually kind of sweet. So you were watching, sis. You won't learn anything from seeing me lose. I was watching your battle, bro. It's how I learned to battle and all that. That right. That reminds me, Marnie, there's something I wanted to tell you. I want you to take over the gym here in Spikemouth as its gym leader. Yeah. I know. You plan to retire after the Champion Cup, right? I think you've become a really great gym leader, even if you don't Dynamax your Pokémon. I love you, but my answer is a big fat no. I mean, when I end up becoming Champion, I won't be able to be a gym leader. Good point. In that case, let your big bro see if you have the skill to be a Champion. Hey, Danielle, thanks for having an amazing Pokémon battle with my brother. It's my turn next, so clear off for a bit, okay? Seriously beat Piers? Here, I tell you I'm just still up to remember this moment. TM85 Snarl. Yells as if it's ranting about something which lowers the special attack stats of opposing Pokemon. Okay then. Hey, it doesn't trouble over on Route 9. It's so bad even the champions come to sort things out. Oh hey, you gave Piers a thrashing, didn't you? You should head over there to help. Come on then. I'll show you the way. Uh I know where Route 9 is. Am I allowed to... What's happening? Kaboom! Danielle, thanks for coming, but I've got a handle on this. Whatever's making that noise, I'll see to it. I already told you, didn't I? Keep your eye on the goal. And for you, that's winning the gym challenge. The only gym badge left is the one you... Oh, there's one left? The one you got from the Dragon Gym's leader, Raihan, right? Raihan is the only trainer out there that I consider a real rival. He's that good, you know? And there I go again. Sorry, but I suppose there's no time for me to st be stopping for a chat. There's a bit of trouble here with my name on it. But don't you worry about a thing. The unbeatable champion is here to look after things and keep you all safe. Kaboom! That came from the tunnel, wouldn't you say? Seems we're about to have a champion time. Uh, am I supposed to follow you or just go back to No, I'm meant to go back. I'm meant to follow you. Okay. So is there actually nothing in Spike Myth apart from the gym? Okay, there's, there's some people here now. Hello. 
At the end of the day, this place would be more lively if there were more gym challenges. I'm a huge fan of Pierre's, I really fancy seeing him in more matches. Even a rundown place like this is important for the people and Pokemon who live here. I guess. So is there... Okay, I was... Okay, I can use my bike now. It counts as being... Uh... Outside, instead of inside. Still no shops or anything? It's just, it's just a really long, empty hallway. Hello. Speaking of peers, he refuses to Dynamax his Pokémon, but the chairman tried to move the gym to a kind of far away place near a power spot. Closing the shutter to sabotage the other challenges was right poor Shaman's sportsmanship. Yeah, it, it was. I won't quit Team Yell, I'll keep cheering for Marnie. I'm looking for a Pokémon trade, how about your Obstagoon for my Cantonian Mr. Mime? Sure, I don't think I have one though. Yeah. Right then, come back whenever. Yeah, there's just nothing in this entire town. It's... It's not, it's not even really a town, it's just a corridor. <sighs> it seems... Like they just forgot to put anything in this, t in this area. Uh... I mean, there's people here now, and you can use your bike and stuff, but... Yep, yeah, I love to rest. I am incredibly disappointed with Spikemouth. I was expecting, you know, some shops and some people to talk to, and like, a, like cool punk clothing I could buy. I guess I did get a dark outfit, which I assume looks kind of like a Team Yell outfit, because Spikemouth is, is Team Yell, basically. They still won't. It's they still won't let me buy um elixirs and ethers. I don't know. Do they do they normally let you do that? I, I can't remember. Is it just like this particular game is just weird? <sighs> well, uh, I guess that's it for now. Um, next time we're gonna pass through the Ratnan Tunnel and make our way back to Hammerlock. I don't know why we wouldn't just fly there, given that we can. I'm, I'm not sure they thought out this narrative in some places. What is that? Oh, hello. Clobberpuss. Oh, that is cute. Oh no, too much damage. Ba-da-ba-dum. ba da I'll have to keep an eye out for more, I guess. Oop. The screen faded out for a sec there. Don't know why. <sighs> well... That's Spike Myth, I guess. It's, it's not really a town. Like, it says here, streets crammed with shops, but you can't use any of them. As far as I can tell, are you supposed to be able to use them? Is it like a glitch? Me? I'm just here as a part-time job. I'm far, far yelling in for the proper league stuff. Alright. Gym challenges make this place lively. Piaz is so cool. Like... I can see a whole bunch of buildings, but you can't go into any of them. Pokemon have got to work hard for a gym trainer like me to do well. Cheers, mates. Yeah, you just can't interact with anything here. Just a really, really long hallway. I don't understand why they would do this. 
Especially when they're claiming that there are shops and stuff that you can interact with that you can't. Um... Oh my goodness. Is this just, like, the worst town in every Pokemon game of all time? <laughs> oh, my goodness gracious. Oh well, I guess next time we're heading back to Hammerlock for some reason. Uh, is Hammerlock where the Dragon Gym is? I don't remember. Or is that one we already did? I kind of figured it would be, you know, up in Winden, but maybe, maybe it's not? I don't remember. Hammerlock Stadium. I think that might be where Raihan is, and then we go, like, through Route 10 here to get to the, uh, Indigo Plateau or whatever. I think. I'm not sure, though. Why is there a picture there? There's no pictures on any of these others. Just, just that one? Because it's the next one we have to go to, I guess? But why, why aren't there pictures for the other ones as well? <sighs> so yeah, this is a game. <laughs> I am incredibly disappointed with this particular town. I am astonished that they didn't put anything in here. Like, a clothes shop. A, a house you can go into, some sort of little side quest thing. There's, there's nothing. There's a trade right at the very end in the in the gym, but most of this is just empty space. And oh my God, why why didn't they put anything in here? <sighs> uh, I guess that's it for for now. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Um, let me know if you were also absolutely astonished that this whole town has nothing in it. Um, despite looking very cool. It's got, you know, all the neon going on. I thought some cool stuff might happen, but nothing. N nothing. <sighs> Bye!